Alright, so in this video I'm going to be um, making a DIY rechargeable battery pack for um, one of my PMR radios. Um, yeah, these are good radios but they run out pretty fast and um, the AA batteries that they take just take standard three AA batteries. They're good radios, they go a fair distance but uh, the batteries tend to run out pretty quick so I'm going to be replacing three, three AA batteries with one of these um, lithium ion rechargeable batteries and uh, these came out of um, old old um, laptop batteries, I salvaged these out of old laptop batteries and uh, this one's um, still a good battery, I've got a few other ones which I'm going to repla eventually replace the rest of them um, but yeah that's what I'm going to be doing anyway so I'm going to start taking this apart Right, so we are, we've got the back off. All I'm going to do is, is just connect this directly to the radio, to the two contacts. Got the positive contact here, negative contact is down here. And I will fit the battery in the back here. I'm going to take all the contacts out and then just jam that straight in there. And then I'm going to use this jack here which will be connected to the battery also and use this to charge it <coughs> right so I pulled the arm um, battery clips out there's battery clips just cut a small piece of plastic out so we can fit the battery in So that fits in there nice. Able to put the back cover back on. So now all I've got to do is just wire it up. So I've got to cut two small pieces of wire. Make sure they were the right length just by laying it side by side. Top will come over easily. And bottom will go to there. And then this is going to be the charge lead and then I shall just uh, wire that I'll bring it through to the back through the plastic and solder it up onto there all right so I'm just going to tin the wires with the um, solder iron first while I solder them Tin the circuit board traces as well. Just make a bit of solder off. Trim a small the wire off because it's too long. And bend it a bit to make it a bit easier to solder. So we've got both wires soldered on the back on the main board. wires through I'm going to pop the 
couple of screws back in just to hold it together. As you can hear, the radio's came on, so we know we've got it wired up right away, but the battery's not fully charged, so that's why it's beeping. So, just need to get it in there now. Alright, so the battery is fitted in there now. Fits in nice. Uh, the radio is turned off, but the battery's not fully charged at the moment, as we said. I'm just going to use a piece of this um, uh, fiberglass reinforced tape. Just to stick those wires down on the back there. Just so they don't get pulled. Do it. and the charge lead. Just going to tuck in the inside there when it's not in use. And there we go. All done. All back together. Two screws in. Right, so there we go. Um, rechargeable battery for a PMR radio. Right, so I thought I'd just show you the one way that I'm charging these batteries. Um, what I've done is just uh, that connector that I put on there is like a Futaba RC um, battery connector. And um, I just connected it up to my um, RC uh, battery charger. It's a Turnergy AccuCell 6 battery charger. Uh, you can charge um, up to six lithium cells at once off this. So, yep, good charger. And that's why I'm charging it. Uh, thanks for watching and see you next time.